So I'm Charlotte, I'm here um, with one of the teams building part of the What If machine. So we're building the second section after the first section here with the pulley in the water. Our section, we're trying to make a marble run. So we are currently making an A-frame with a golf club. So we use the energy from the first part of the What If machine to then hit the golf ball, which will then be lifted up. We haven't identified how we do that yet. And then we do a very traditional marble run. So the golf ball will run along each section. We've got to bounce um, and then into that plastic bowl there. And then it ultimately ends up in that tube. Um, and that's where it finishes. I have no um, no engineering skills, no um, practical st no practical bones in my body, so it's um, it's good fun. It's a bit of a learning curve. My name is Baptiste Fabrice. Um, I'm here with my team, my dad and the friends, and we're trying to get balls to go down tunnels and make them relay and maybe get some things to fall over. And I think the most challenging thing is to get things to fall how we want them to and to get things, because there's, sometimes there's a few unpredictable changes that might happen. So you might have the ball that doesn't go where you want it to, so we'll have to adapt things and change as we go on. It's fun because I get to have fun with my dad and have more quality time. The What If machine is all about asking, what if? What if we could create this fantastic over-engineered machine that tells us all about the evolution of this very site being widely recognised as the world's first factory? What if we could bring all these fantastic people together to share their ingenuity, imagination, their creativity with everyone to make this fantastic, incredible machine? And the biggest what if question is, what if it actually works? And that's what we all want to know, right? Woo! <laughs>